Tornadoes form on warm, humid days when thunderstorms are present. In general, the most dangerous tornadoes occur from supercells. While not all thunderstorms produce tornadoes, all tornadoes form in the presence of thunderstorms. Thunderstorms are characterized by cumulonimbus clouds, lightning, and lightning's acoustic effect on the atmosphere, thunder. They most often develop in the warmer months of spring, summer, and early fall with the presence of three main weather features. An unstable atmosphere, warm, humid air, and something to trigger upward or vertical motion. In the U.S., strong thunderstorms capable of producing tornadoes most frequently develop in an area referred to as Tornado Alley. The following synoptic conditions help make Tornado Alley so dangerous. A low pressure system strengthens as it moves off the Rockies and into the plains. The counterclockwise rotation associated with a low pressure system pulls warm and moist air northward from the Gulf of Mexico. At the same time, cold air from the north moves in behind this system, creating a cold front that extends southward from the center of the low pressure system. Thus, the warm and humid air is present, the rising motion associated with a low pressure system supplies the instability, and the cold front sweeps through as a trigger. This setup can happen any time of the year, but the conditions are more favorable for severe thunderstorms in the warmer months of spring and summer into early fall. This is why tornadoes are more often a threat from late April to mid-June. While tornadoes are most likely to develop in Tornado Alley, stretching across the plains from Texas into the Dakotas, tornadoes have been reported in every U.S. state since 1950, not including Guam, the Virgin Islands, American Samoa, and Puerto Rico.